Bereshit, Genesis 39. And Yosef was brought down to Mitzrayim, and Potiphar, an officer of Pharaoh, captain of the guard, a Mitzri, bought him of the hands of the Yishmael Elim, which had brought him down thither. And Yahuwah was with Et Yosef, and he was a prosperous man, and he was in the house of his master, the Mitzri. And his master saw that Yahuwah was with him, and that Yahuwah made all that he did to prosper in his hand. And Yosef found grace in his sight, and he served him, and he made him overseer over his house, and all that he had he put into his hand. And it came to pass from the time that he had made him overseer in his house, and over all that he had, that Yahuwah blessed at the Mitzri's house for Yosef's sake. And the blessing of Yahuwah was upon all that he had in the, in the house and in the field. And he left all that he had in Yosef's hand. And he knew not aught he had, save the bread which he did eat. And Yosef was a goodly person and well favored. And it came to pass after these things that his master's woman cast at her eyes upon El Yosef, and she said, Lie with me. But he refused and said unto his master's woman, Behold, my master knows not what is with me in the house, and he has committed all that he has to my hand. There is none greater in this house than I, Neither has he kept back anything from me but you, because you are at his woman. How then can I do this great wickedness and sin against Elohim? And it came to pass, as she spoke to El Yosef day by day, that he hearkened not unto her to lie by her or to be with her. And it came to pass about this time that Yosef went into the house to do his business, and there was none of the men of the house there within. And she caught him by his garment, saying, Lie with me. And he left his garment in her hand and fled and got him out. And it came to pass when she saw that he had left his garment in her hand and was fled forth, that she called unto the men of her house and spoke unto them, saying, See, he has brought in in ivory unto us to mock us. He came in unto me to lie with me, and I cried with a loud voice. And it came to pass, when he heard that I lifted up my voice and cried, that he left his garment with me and fled and got him out. And she laid up his garment by her until his Lord came home. And she spoke unto him according to these words, saying, The Ivri servant which you have brought unto us came in unto me to mock me. And it came to pass, as I lifted up my voice and cried, that he left his garment with me and fled out. And it came to pass, when his master heard at the words of his woman, which she spoke unto him, saying, After this manner did your servant to me, that his wrath was kindled. And Yosef's master took him and put him into the prison, a place where the king's prisoners were bound, and he was there in the prison. But Yahuwah was with at Yosef, and showed him mercy, and gave him favor in the sight of the keeper of the prison. And the keeper of the prison committed to Yosef's hand at all the prisoners that were in the prison, and at whatsoever they did there, he was the doer of it. The keeper of the prison looked at not to anything that was under his hand because Yahuwah was with him, 
and that which he did, Yahuwah, made it to prosper.